welcome back to my channel so today um i'm going to be showing you a little bit of uh, what my surface dog and training maggie does um she is a ptsd mobility medical alert and response asthma attack alert and allergy detection service dog and so we are still working with treats she is still learning new tasks every single day and so basically what i will be showing you is some things that she is learning some things that she is still like working on and some things that she knows she may make a couple of mistakes because we're not in a public access area but when she's in public she is fine sit down good girl and so another thing is i'm working with treats and she is very treat motivated. And so right now she's doing a focus, which is good. Yes. And I do work with a, a prong collar, head collar, and e collar. So right now I'm just working with a prong. Um, yes, I know. Oh, you guys are I'm gonna get a lot of hate, so and mostly hate on my prong but i am very educated on prong collars i am very educated on head collars and stuff i always keep mine at the base of the neck and so when i give her a correction she feels it i just think it quickly and so yeah yeah So one other thing I'm going to work on is so she can uh, grab uh, her, um, the very first thing I'm going to show you is she knows how to retrieve items for me. We're still working on this because some, sometimes uh, she don't understand it yet. So I'm going to drop the, her head collar. Maggie, up. Ready? You ready? Give it! Give it! Yes! Come! Come! And the reason why she's walking funny is because she's still getting used to having a handle on her back. And especially a long handle. This is my new pull strap handle. I use this for on buses because um, I use this for mostly guide work so she can guide me. But I'm just getting her desensitized to having it on her back because it's like always going to be on her. And so it is something new for her because uh, she's not really, she's used to having like a shorter handle on her back and not a long one. So, yeah, thank you. Uh -uh. Jump. Focus. Yes. Come. Yes. Good focus. Stay. Come. Down. Down. Yes. Make Leash. Bring. Yes. Come. Yes. Maggie, 
Now this is one, technically it's a trick, but it's also one way that I ask her to alert. Um, we're just working on this, uh, which is her giving me a paw. Maggie, paw. Yes. And so the reason why I'm asking her to give me a paw is because in the near future, I want her to paw at my leg. Because right now she's just nudging at my leg. And we're also working on that task as well. So I'll show you that task. I have a treat to my hand. Yes! So she did some something that I never expected. So I'm going to be giving her a treat. Good girl. Good girl. And we're going to try it again. Now, I want to give a shout out to one the channel. And that is Jedi Knight 575. He is a video game gamer. He plays Hollow and a couple other things. So, he is one of the best um, channels that I've ever watched. And I know, personally do know him by heart. I've met him in person. I'm not going to tell him, tell you guys his real name. But then please go watch his channel because simple fact, he is one of the greatest like, YouTubers ever in the video game area. So that is a self harm because in the sometimes I beat my chest, sometimes I beat my legs. Yes, she barks for a lot of things actually. Um, here's another thing that she barks for. <laughs> Another thing she'll do is leave it. Leave it. Leave it. Leave it. Bring. Yes. So, she did this fabulous without a treat. And this is another thing we're working on. I'm working on her putting her nose through by herself. So, this is when I use her head collar. Good girl. Yes. Maggie, get dressed. Yes. Maggie, get dressed. Ah, uh -uh. get dressed. Yes. And she does wear this. Um, she wears three items on her, a flat collar, and that's just not for her high collar.
see she is very focused on me, which is good. Yes. Good girl. You can have that one. Yes. This is basically what a service dog is supposed to be. You like, it's supposed to be able to task train to be able to perform a task. Okay, so in public, I do not have to correct her at all. I'll correct her mostly if I need to, but she is very good. Um, she's been training for about a year now. And she's been, she is my seventh service dog. Good. So right here, she is behind me. And that is considered a cover. Maggie. Yes. Maggie. Cover. So, behind here is a block, in front is a cover, so she's in the cover right now. So, before she was in a block, between, yes, so right here it is a front tuck between me for and the reason why I have her go through my legs and lay down is because if we're in the middle of, say, an appointment and everything else, this is one way for her to tuck. So, I'm going to ask her out. Maggie, out. Come. Leash. Yes. So this is another thing, Maggie, up. I use a, a handle on her vest for groundwork. So if I use a vest, I use it for grounding and also counterbalance. This is just something for her to get used to because in the near future she will be a mobility service dog so I'm trying to get her used to having a handle on her and so this is another thing she'll be doing. Peggy, stand. Brace. I'm not putting that really any weight into her. I'm just like brace. Getting her used to of hearing the word brace, 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 brace. Good girl. Yes. So one other thing that uh, she knows is she knows depression therapy. So Maggie, over. All the way down. Good girl. Pressure. Pressure. Good. And she uses uh, deep pressure therapy for many things. She uses it for like a pain attack, an anxiety attack, or also when I'm about to pass. I feel like I'm about to pass out. Um, she does no guide work. So, I will show you that in the, in the near. Um, I'm not really doing it fully. It's just something that for her to get used to. Good. So, I don't mind her getting up. She didn't hit it a lot longer than she normally has. We're working on it. 
she's still in training. In my state, she is allowed to go out in the public because she actually technically does know TASIS. Um, by the Americans with Disabilities Act, a service dog only needs to know three or more tasks to become a fully task trained service dog and considered one, even though I'm adding on. So she knows deep pressure therapy, asthma type alert, and also what I'm about to also show you, and that is guide work, or in my case, for momentum and guide work. Maggie, hop, hop. Yes, but also she does know the pickup items for me, so for instance, leash retrieval. Uh oh. Yes. Uh oh. Yes. Uh oh. Yes. Good girl. It took her a very long time to get used to doing leash retrieval. Even though she has retriever in her, she really did not know how to retrieve. So I had to teach her. So she'll do a silent bark, she'll do a loud bark, and then she'll do a medium bark. Down! Stay! Good girl! So I dropped the leash on accident, and she was over there. She broke her down, her stay, and her sits. <clears throat> To get the leash, which is what I want her to do. Come. Leave it. Yes. One other thing that we're working on. And that is. To go under my leg. So this is actually going to be a new task for her. And this is what will happen. I'm just going to reposition her. Oh, go on. Yes. Stay. And the legs is because she, this helps me when I have severe knee pain and say I'm walking a long time and I gotta stop, she will do this to relieve my knee pain for a little bit. Maggie, focus. Focus. Yes. 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 
Hey, Maggie. Ow! Come! I'm going to let her get a drink first. And then we'll move on. Like I said, she's still learning new tasks every single day. The only reason why I have service dog on her vest and not in training is because with that, um, she's still considered a service dog, but she's just learning and this one's like her training vest. And not her everyday vest. Her everyday vest is actually a, a harness for guide work and mobility. So I would be sensitizer to that. So, and also it has cape, a cape on it. Stay. So, I'm going to show you her everyday harness. Her everyday harness is this right here. This is actually one of her harnesses. Um, this has a multi-purpose service dog and training, do not pet, and a please do not pet me patch. I'm working. And then surface walking training do not touch ah, ah. over down and then an ADA and then I will also have this service log patch on her because I do train her at night and go out in public like at night so I'll have something that is reflective on her. But then, stay. There's a couple of times I will also have this Leave it. Over. Over. Down. I will also have. Don't you fucking dare touch this service lock. So, this is basically her everyday setup. I also have find these two working leash straps on it. They're sleeves by Canine Friendly. I have those on my handle at all times, and normally it's in this position, so I can use this for grounding and to get her used to pulling me, but not really pulling, um, and doing guide work. But some occasions where, when I'm walking. She will use, I will use this just in my, in motion for grounding and that's it. And then I will use this also for bracing. But I will not brace on her fully until she is cleared by a vet at age two. And this harness is nine e Etienne Maker, if I'm saying it right. Uh, this is my favorite harness of the most. And the reason why is it's these little, like, zip tie things instead of the buckle. And they're a little bit easier. So, yeah. Um...
so like I said thank you for watching and I hope you to see you guys soon and I'm sorry for not posting a lot on my YouTube channel it's been very harsh for me I've been going through a lot because of this perfect virus that's going in the US but not only that because I have been feeling well and I have been working a lot as well so I can get my service dog gear my emotional support animal some um, gear for when he goes out to be a therapy animal in the near future but on top of this so my service dog can do her public access test her very first one to see if she can continue being a service dog um and continue being learning how to become a service dog and and that test will be next month so thank you for watching i hope you can we'll see you guys soon and if you like this move this video please like subscribe and comment down below what else do you want me to do thanks for watching